my goal for the Meta AI launch, which I mean, it's only really you know, a few months old at this point, was to, by the end of the year, um, have Meta AI be the most used AI assistant in the world. And I, I think we're basically on track for that. I mean, there's hundreds of millions of people who are by using By the end it. of this year? Yeah, and I think we're going to be there before the end of the year. So you're releasing Llama 3.1, this family mm -hmm. of models, big yeah. and small, including the biggest open source model ever, mm -hmm. 405 billion parameters. Yeah. Yeah. What does that jump unlock? I actually think the main thing that people are going to do, especially because it's open source, is use it as a teacher to train smaller models that they use in different applications. If you just think about like all the startups out there, or all the enterprises, or even governments that are trying to do different things, they probably all need to, at some level, build custom models for what they're doing. And it's really hard to do that with closed systems out there, whether that's OpenAI or Gemini, Google's thing, or whatever. And, and this is like gets to a pretty core part of our philosophy is we don't believe there's going to be like one AI to rule them all. Our vision is that there's going to be millions or just billions of different models out there. So not one god, but many? Is that the way to think about it? Well, I don't think there are going to be gods. But, <laughs> um...